Good morning guys. Okay, so it is Friday morning, which means it's weigh-in day. Um, so first of all, I'm just going to start by telling you how my week went. Um, last week in my weigh-in video, I had told you that I was going to set myself two goals for this week. The first one being to not eat out, and the second one being to um, measure, weigh, count for, track absolutely everything I eat. And the second part to that was to not go over my weekly points. Um, and I'm sad to say that I failed on both of those goals. Um, so, that's shitty. <laughs> Anyways, um, but I'm here to be honest with you guys. I could very easily, you know, be like, yeah, I did great. <laughs> um, but I'm not going to do that. So, basically, the not eating out thing, I did eat out on for lunch on um, Sunday. Um, and not to make an excuse or to try and justify why I did it, but just to kind of explain to you guys why I ate out. Um, basically, like, we're in the home stretch here right now. Um, we're moving a week tomorrow. We're moving. Oh my god, so surreal. Um, and it's just, it's getting, <laughs> every, every day that goes by, every week that goes by, it's getting more and more unbearable almost. There's just too many moods in one house. Uh, we'll just put it that way. So the weekends are the worst because absolutely everybody is home on the weekends. Um, and so literally we found in the last few weekends we just have been going out just to not be here. And it's quite depressing actually because it's like all we feel like doing is just kind of relaxing at home, but we don't really, we feel like we don't really have a home to go to to relax at because we want to get away from this place, which is the whole point of why we're out. And then if we end up being out at lunchtime or whatever, especially with my daughter, she's two years old, so like when she wants lunch, when she's hungry, she needs to have lunch or whatever, um, then we end up being like, okay, well, what can we do while we're out? Well, let's go for lunch. That's kind of what ended up happening. That's exactly what happened on Sunday. Um, we we went out Sunday morning. Um, and then it was lunchtime and we were all hungry, so we went. However, and I didn't do good, I we went to A&W and yeah, it wasn't good. Um, however, I did track it. I looked up the nutrition information for exactly what I ate online and I tracked it. Um, and then I worked out, I went on the tread climber for an hour on Sunday night to, um, balance that out so that I wasn't over. And with my workout, my hour long workout, I was drenched. My legs were throbbing. Like I like sweat dripping down into my eye. Like it was, yeah, it was an hour and I'd gone faster than I've ever gone on the tread climber too. Um... Normally, up until this week, the fastest I've been able to go on the tread climber has been 3.5 miles per hour, and on Sunday I went 3.8 miles per hour. Um, it was it was an insane workout. I burned 808 calories, um, and yeah, so I was really proud of myself for not just being like, oh, well, I did bad, so whatever. I still tracked it, and then I did what I had to do to make sure that that didn't put me over my points that day. Um, now as far as counting, weighing, measuring, tracking absolutely everything that I eat this week, um, it's, it was much better this week than it had been in previous weeks because that's something that has been just slipping further and further from me um, in the last few weeks. Just grabbing a few crackers here or there and not counting them or whatever. Or, like, wine gums has been my big thing. My parents always have wine gums in the house. These are things that are going to get a heck of a lot easier, these problems, when we move, um, too. Because, A, when we move, we'll have our own place. So, there won't be that, you know, desire to be like, well, I just got to get out of the house and hang out of the house this, this day or whatever. Like, we'll have our own house that we can hang out at and stuff like that. Um... So the, the issue for eating out on the weekends won't be there. And then also, um, this whole thing, like there's just, there's always so much crap food around this house and it's hard to 
to say no, but even though it is hard to say no, I've gone the last however many months saying no still, and it's just lately it's been whatever. Um, but yeah, wine gums are always sitting out on the counter, and so that's one thing where I'll grab one here, two there, you know, one here, one there, you know, and um, it adds up, but I don't ever count it. And so I still have done that this week. Like I say, not as bad as previous weeks, and I'm going to continue to work on that. For next week, I'm going to really, really put emphasis on not just randomly snacking on things without counting them out and calculating them. Um, so I will follow up with that again next Friday to let you know. And hopefully next Friday I'll be saying, I did it guys! I didn't have anything without, you know, measuring it and counting for it and everything. Um, so, that's that. Okay, um, so my weigh-in. I weighed in this morning at 174.2, so frig, ah, that's .2 away from my 40 pounds lost. I was like, should I just cut off some of my hair or something? Like, it just, I want that .2, um, .2, I'm, I'm down a total of 39.8 now. Come on, give me the 40 pounds. Anyways, it's a loss of 1.4 this week, uh, so I'm happy with that, that's, you know, that's great, um, that's awesome, 1.4 loss week, that's good, <laughs> um, I'm just, I'm upset because I'm so close to that 40 pounds mark, but anyways, I'll hit it next week for sure. Now, challenges coming up this week, um, like I say, the weekends around here are the worst, so this weekend, being our last weekend here, um, we have decided to, we're going to go stay in a hotel tomorrow night, um, Saturday night. My daughter, my husband, and I are going to go stay in a hotel tomorrow night. Um, so we'll eat breakfast tomorrow here before we leave, and then we got some errands to run and stuff. We're just going to, we're just planning on just spending the day out tomorrow, um, and then, uh, so, like, for lunch or whatever, I'm thinking, you know, we'll go to, like, Subway or something because my favorite thing at Subway right now is the sweet onion chicken teriyaki salad, and it's only, like, five points or something. Um, so that's what I'll have for lunch, so my lunch will be pretty low still. Um, and, yeah, and then we'll have dinner out, and this is, this is where I'm, like, changing. I get, I'm changing back to where I used to be because... Before it's like, oh, we're having dinner out, so I'm going to get a burger and fries and I'm going to do really bad. But no, I'm going to um, go, I think we're going to go to Moxie's or whatever because it's attached to the hotel. So I'm going to go on, look for nutritional information and uh, consciously pick a healthier dish. Um, so yeah, so hopefully that's not too bad. And then Sunday morning we'll probably have breakfast from out. So breakfast is the hardest thing to eat out for me. Um, but, you know, I'll just maybe try and get, like, eggs and something, <laughs> I don't know, um, fruit or something, eggs and fruit, it's actually a good breakfast. Anyways, um, so that's that, uh, yeah, I hope everybody had a wonderful week. Oh, and one other thing, um, I think I'm gonna make a separate video on this, but I am going to be starting P90X on, like, the Lean program. There's three different uh, programs on P90X. There's the Lean program, the regular program, and the doubles program. The Lean program basically focuses more, like it still is like essentially the same workouts, but you do uh, different workouts on different days and it puts more focus on like cardio and weight loss rather than um, weightlifting or whatever. Anyways, so I'm going to do the P90X Lean program starting on April 8th um, and I would like to like try and get like a few people to do it with me because it'll just help keep me motivated, keep everybody motivated. Um, so yeah, but I think I'll do a separate video on that. Um, yeah, so anyways, that's that. Uh, okay, so yeah, this next week I will count for, measure, track everything I eat. You will hear great things from me next week. 
and next week I will be down over 40 pounds. <laughs> Alright, thanks for watching guys.